The simplest way to describe a hip pointer is a really, really, really bad cork to the hip. When you land or you cop a blow to the hip in that area, it just squashes that muscle into that bone. And it's just an area you can get quite a bit of bleeding. It's an area that you rely on for a lot of function. They're super, super painful in the following days, sort of when that bruising sets in. He can just get hurt easier because that hip is sensitive where usually he could cop a big blow to that hip and it not be an issue. Now it won't take much and that hip will aggravate again. So they do need to before the game. They probably need him pre-game as well. He won't have to have that period before half time where he was not in such good place because after the half he looked pretty good someone said you know the magic hands of the physio but i was like oh yeah the magic hands of a local anesthetic i think probably would have been the big thing <laughs> more like a 10 day turnaround rather than a seven day even i mean that's massive for hit pointers you can just take an extra 24 48 hours and he should be hopefully significantly better